Hi and welcome back to the Harma channel. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Today we'll be talking about how to pick a mentor. Even if you're in real estate or any other industry, we all know it's so important to have a mentor. Stay tuned all the way to the end. You don't want to miss this. Let's talk about mentors and let's talk about what are the things you should look for when you pick a mentor. Mentors are going to help you build your business. They are very essential part of your journey, especially if you're new to the business and you pick the wrong mentor, they can actually discourage you or you might not like the industry because of them. It's important to take your time and pick the right mentor. One of the first thing mentors should do to hold you accountable to the goals that you set. And sometimes, I don't know if you will experience this, but I was discouraged in the first year in real estate by my mentor pushed me. And sometimes he believed in me more than I believed in myself. That's a good mentor. You also want to pick a mentor that it has a proven record. There are a lot of mentors out there. They call themselves mentors, but if you look at their track record, they have nothing to show. Numbers don't lie. So look at their track record. Also make sure they're relevant to what you're doing, to the market we're in. If they've been doing this for 40 years, they most probably have a bad habits and they're not interested in what's going on today. They already had their book of business. So you want to pick a mentor that they can grow you with current market not what has happened 40 years ago. Something else the mentors should do, they should allow you to shadow them. You don't want a mentor who's just sitting there and waiting for you to ask them questions. You want a mentor that takes you on the street, in action, and you get to see them what it takes to sell real estate. I always say, cutting the fish is easy, which is the textbook, all the contracts, all the disclosures. Getting the fish is the art. And if you don't get to be on, on the street and deal with the sellers and buyers directly, you will never learn. Pick a mentor that can help you and don't let anyone's limitation put a cap on your potential. And the last thing I think it's very important, mentor's job is to help you outgrow them. If the mentor doesn't believe that and they don't think you can never outgrow them, that's not the right match. You always need a mentor, but every journey will need a new mentor. So the question today is, are you going to do residential or commercial? And don't forget to leave those in comments. Thank you for watching this video. I want to know what other topics you would like me to make video on. Feel free to leave those in a comment and don't forget to subscribe.